Fine, I'll take a break. But just a short one, hear me? Uh -huh. You don't seem too bothered at all over it. Shut up! Take me with you. This will be my first time in the ocean. Smartphones are totally waterproof nowadays. Please? I know this phone can go underwater. I just checked again. Oh yeah! We're all going wild today. beautiful. <laughs> oh, well, it's some detailed work for a bunch of <laughs> damn kids! Get back here, you're all under arrest!
Mensore! Is that everything? Thank I should write something. Contributes to the mysterious vibe here. Oh, looks like a dare to me. Come on, who's willing to go the farthest past it? Nope, this is the end of the line. There's an Utaki down that way. See, there, on the sign? What's an Utaki? Basically, it's a land that's been considered holy since the Ryukyu era. People used to believe the gods lived there, or at least came to work there. Locals still revere the places, even today. Going down there for a laugh could get you in real trouble. That stuff here. I'm surprised you know all that. Well, Investigation 101 says to know your territory. Feel free to keep buttering me up, though. Does that mean there are Ryukyu era customs still being practiced today? Yep. Reverence of the incomprehensible is ingrained deep in human consciousness. Well, I'm sure you have no interest in pissing off a god today. Let's all listen to the sign and get out of here. No, those festoons work differently. But now that you mention it, it is kind of strange. I checked online for any relevant information, but this place does not appear to have any real significance. The other subjects here are far more interesting, such as the shape of the coastline, the sounds of the waves crashing, and the oceanic life forms. A person's values can affect what makes an impact on them. It might be insignificant to you, but to others, this place may be very sacred. It depends on my values. My apologies. Inari stomach. Right on time, as always. Oh, well, I'm starving too. I bet we all worked up an appetite out there. Should we finally kick off our long-awaited barbecue? Uh, hell yeah! Time for an Okinawan meat festival! Don't forget the curry! We gotta make some tropical edition LeBlanc curry! Uh, that's not exactly barbecue food. Also, didn't you already have curry on the ferry? Hmm. I accept your challenge. Curry will be a perfect complement to the searing white sands of this tropical paradise. That makes no sense at all. Seriously, what is with you two and curry? Hey. Thank 
Keeper earlier, when you gave me the underwater tour, it was a fascinating experience. And something no AI could ever do on their own. I guess you could say it made my heart feel full. Although, I don't have a heart. It's a simple fact. There is no need to attempt to spare the feelings I lack. I am still going to try to understand what feelings are, though. I came to that realization when I first stared out at the sea. For example, being with you and the other Phantom Thieves, it's quite fun. Yes, fun. Did I get that right? I got it. I understand. Okay. I. Mm -hmm. Hey, pick up the pace. We got a whole lot of cooking ahead of us. Oh, oh man, this meat is so good. Hey, you saw me about to grab that piece. The curry is divine as always. And with these leftovers, we're sure to dine on curry udon tomorrow. Let's ignore the fact that you're already planning tomorrow's dinner. Why not add deep fried tofu for Inari curry udon? We've been eating nothing but the most delicious food since this trip began. Traveling makes it a lot easier to lose track of one's diet. I should be more careful. Huh? But you're so toned, Makoto. Right? <laughs> Have I really put on weight? I mean, who cares if you've packed on a few extra pounds? It probably gives your punches some extra oomph. Wanna test your theory? No, please, I don't! Hmm. What is it, Zenkichi? Upset stomach? Hmm? Oh, nah. Something bothering you? It's probably nothing. Let's wrap up. We gotta wake up early tomorrow. Okay. Hey, guys. Something's up. Yeah? What's that? Keep it down. And listen. I think... They can't be far! Find them! We have they to punch them when they're filing the hollow ground! Find them! We'll they make an offering out of them! Where are them. they? They couldn't have gotten far! Spread out! Come on! They can't Come on! Find they're them. somewhere! Dude, what the hell is going on? Those guys are effing nuts! No kidding. If Zenkichi hadn't picked up on what was about to happen... He said something about defiling hollowed ground. What's that supposed to mean? They'd have some sort of warning up if it was hallowed ground, though. I didn't see anything like that when we pulled up to the beach. Wait, maybe it's actually the lamb. Remember that straw festoon we saw on the entrance? That's right. We saw it, then proceeded further anyway. Hang on, hang on. What's so friggin' hollow about some lab? And even if it is hollowed, that doesn't explain how they're acting at all. They look like they want to kill us. It doesn't matter how we look at it, these people have lost their minds. Wait, could this be... And that would mean 
and there's a monarch somewhere around here, yeah? But Sophia said she can't smell a jail here. Correct. I cannot smell any jails here. However, you did also say you got a bad feeling from this place. Considering our current situation, I can only assume it's due to a changing of their hearts. But nobody tried to attack us until just now. Perhaps there really is something on this island. Something even Sophia can't detect. What do we do now? They'll catch us if we just stay here. Good idea. That place is hallowed ground to them, so they might not be willing to go there. Actually, if we plan on trespassing somewhere they don't want us, shouldn't we go to the lab? What do you mean, Gramps? It's pretty obvious, based on how they treat that place, there's something fishy there. No matter where we go on this island, they'd catch us eventually. Why not strike at the heart of the matter right away? By heart of the matter, do you mean a jail? However, there is no jail. Sure there's no jail, but I'd bet we'll at least find something in their holy land. And it sure sounds like a better plan than waiting in the bushes until they find us, right? I've got to agree. Okay, let's head for the lab. Wait, how are we getting there? Without getting spotted? <laughs> what are you asking me for? Aren't you guys the Phantom Thieves? Well, those abilities are only relevant in the cognitive world. You just gotta go with the flow. Follow my lead. And keep your voices down. Uh, we lost them, right? Yeah, looks like the coast is clear. That's surprising. I expected guards to be posted here more so than anywhere else. Wait, listen. Footsteps, hide. What's he doing? I can't exactly tell from over here. This could actually be good for us. There's only one guy. If we capture him, we might be able to question him. <laughs> Don't worry. Leave it to the professional. You're doing it by yourself, Gramps? I've been through enough training. I'll be fine. You guys just stay here and keep an eye out for any of his buddies. Holy crap! Gramps just got way cooler! Hello, excuse me? Scout! You dare defile our lord's hallowed ground? <laughs> oh, wow. Watch your step there. You all right? Not again. You totally threw him on his ass. Hey, it was clearly self-defense. He truly is a member of public security. Hey, take a look at that. The sign we saw this morning. Look again. The 18th was changed to the 19th. Apparently, the facility's staff is on permanent vacation, one day at a time. Why would they do this? Most likely, to string along anyone who came to the island for the lab. When someone thinks the staff's out for the day, they probably stick around the island. Come nighttime, the locals descend on whoever got too curious to protect whatever's in there. What horrid tactics. Well, let's investigate a bit. If his heart's been changed, he should have a smartphone with Emma installed. Up, oh, found it. Yep, there's Emma, all right. And he only has one friend? Shuzo Ubukata? There's a chance this Ubukata is the monarch of Okinawa. Anyone got a keyword? Ah, uh, that one's a lot tougher. Oh, hang on. There's an email here. A cordial invitation to serve as a tester of the Emma system. An Emma tester? Oh, this even has a keyword in it. Operation Oraculi? Who sent him the email? I don't recognize the address. Maybe it's from the lab? The lab asked all of these guys to be Emma testers? What now? Thanks to the email, we know the keywords Operation Oraculi. If the people who call this place hollowed have their hearts changed, then it's going to be jail related, without a doubt. But, like, we can't find a jail here, right, Sophia? I'm not sure. At the very least, I do not smell one. He 
Ben's right. If we can't get in, that'll settle it. But if there is a jail here, testing the keyword will send us right in. Are we all ready? We have no choice but to try. Our pursuers have decided our path. Yeah, even the metaverse feels safer to me than this place does now. Okay, let's do it. Emma, add Shuzo Ubukata to my friend registry. Keyword, Operation Oraculi. Ah, uh, guess it doesn't work. Wait, I can descend his op- Keyword successfully entered. Beginning navigation. Is this the lab? It's kind of eerie. Bad vibes here, guys. This place looks straight up haunted. Uh, Queen, <gasps> you alright? Uh, <laughs> uh, yep, all fine here. <laughs> you sure don't sound fine. Uh. <laughs> Screw you too, Ken! Wait, I didn't know you two were... Was entered. Ah, huh. so now this is a new wrinkle. You appear to have entered quite the conundrum. Hmm. What awaits you here in these lands is an inhuman being. This is where she. No, I oughtn't speak any further. My duty is to witness your path laid before you by your decisions. You must witness for yourself the being I have mentioned. As for why I have called you here, a new form of persona execution is now at your disposal. You may now perform the Triad Fusion, a group execution harnessing special power. Triad fusions allow you to generate even more powerful personas. Please make wise use of it in preparation for the trials ahead. Farewell. Welcome to the Velvet Room. You wish to browse the end? What will you be read? Would you like to- This persona has been registered. Please take a look. Awaken your new self. that it can get choose which skill to inherit.
You wish to browse the entries? Please take a look. Is this okay? You may take it with you. You have no personas to register. Awaken your new self. You wish to strengthen it? How much power will you add? This is what... This is what... The power of your mask has strengthened this persona. Performing a fusion? It seems that it can get... Choose which... Is this the... Be born anew! Strengthen it. May luck be on your side. Hmm? What's up? Anyways, if all the people on this island, we've got to get them those desi- Good point. This really is real, isn't it? Ugh, sorry. Yeah, leave it to us. Yes, sir. Just a moment, Sophie. I hear a voice deep. What do you mean? I can hear someone. Hey, wait! Let's go, Joker. Hmm. <sighs> 